Atenio showed no remorse despite playing in a non-bearing as it ripped University of Santo Tomas apart, 102-62, in the UP season 81 men's basketball tournament Wednesday at Mall of Asia Arena. The Blue Eagles already locked up a twice-to-beat advantage going into the game against the eliminated Growling Tigers, but the defending champions' new momentum was still of utmost importance for them going to the semifinals. A 16-0 start was enough for the defending champions, who own a league-best 12-2 record, to hold off the Growling Tigers who are missing star rookie CJ Cancino due to an ACL tear he suffered in their last game against University of the Philippines. Must ended their season with 5-9 record for the sixth seed, a four-game improvement from their 1-13 finish in season 80. Ateneo assistant coach Sandy Aris Bacachaga said that even though they were assured of the top spot in the standings and a twice-to-beat perk, they wouldn't let relax one bit. The mentality in this game was this was not a no-bearing game, said Eris Pakichaga who handled the team in the absence of head coach Tab Baldwin who had underwent some medical exams. Our players were serious and we wanted to make sure our players were serious from the start, because us it's a dangerous team, and we wanted our preparations heading into the final four to go forward. We didn't want to take a step back or relax. Atenio pushed the ante in the third quarter, taking a 44 point lead, 83 39, after Isaac goes free throws with 56 seconds left in the period. Angelo Cowan led the Blue Eagles with 22 points, 10 rebounds, and 3 blocks, while William Navarro added 17 points and 5 boards. Renzo Subido paced us with 18 points, while Toby Agustin had 15 points and 9 boards. Joshua Marcos also had a solid contribution for the Growling Tigers with 13 points and 5 rebounds.